All right, everybody, and in today's video, we're going to be talking about if Pirates New Dream is a bad game. So just for some context behind this question, if you don't know already, the game's going through a lot right now. Like, the devs keep making simple mistakes, and the community isn't handling it well at all. You know, it's a big mess. Uh, there's tons of bugs, hitbox bugs, you know, just bugs with the game crew bugs. It's like a very unfinished game, and it is their first project. So we do have to cut them some slack, and... I feel like the community is responding this way because we've gotten so many high quality games within the past few months like Type Soul, Peroxide, um, you know, games like GPO have always existed which pretty much set the standard for games like this. But even with all of this, it doesn't necessarily make it right for, you know, us as a community to be responding in this way. Um, even though it's probably not going to stop, um, you know, it's better that we should. But uh, yeah. As for the actual game itself, um, this is a one piece game uh, based off of PvP to level up. Not many like it on the app, it's pretty much first of its kind to be on such a global scale. You know, there has been other games like this, but you know, they're mainly CC. But that's the thing here guys, this might be kind of a hot take, but I feel like this game should have actually stayed in close community. Not saying if the game is good or bad just yet, I just feel like this type of game is not meant for the public. And if they really truly did want to go down the public route, they could have added more content to the game. Not saying this game has like zero amount of content at all, it has a decent amount, but it's just not enough for this game to survive past a month. And I'm not saying this to send out hate towards the game or anything, I do actually want this game to genuinely succeed. Um, I'm actually enjoying it a lot right now, but you know, I can tell that this game is not going to last a month because while they're here fixing bugs daily that should have been fixed before the game released, it's looking like we're going to be doing the same stuff, uh, capturing islands, going to executions, which are actually pretty fun. But you know, the execution thing, it doesn't happen too much. And when it does happen, it's pretty much infested with Marines. In the capturing islands, uh, you know, there's a big chance like nobody's gonna be there to start with. We also do have Rampage, but it's not as efficient as it was on the first day due to them making the smart but dumb decision of reducing the server size by half pretty much um it was like 40 to 25 something like that and you know that's fine because they're trying to optimize the game but whenever you have the pvp to progress and there's tons of islands like 25 people scattered around all of that like and you got to take into account that some of them might not be um you know high enough level for you to actually get any progression like it's kind of tough to progress we also do have the coliseum but like Let's be honest here, when's like when has anybody actually participated in one? But yeah guys, that's pretty much what we have to work with in terms of content. Not a lot, like I said. Now I'm gonna talk a little bit about the PvP. To put it into short, like the PvP is solid, you know. Um there's bugs here and there. The first day hitboxes were scuffed, but like right now, like, you know, PvP is solid. It's actually one of the best things in this game. If it wasn't good, then there wouldn't be four thousand people on it right now. The only bad thing I have to say about this PvP is not really about the PvP itself, but like whenever you're at like a home island like Cory Island or Alabasta, whenever you're done fighting with someone, like you're regening or whatever, but they can instantly come get you back and you know that's pretty stupid because once they keep wearing you down and continuously fighting you and like at some point you're not gonna get progression at all and you're basically just gonna be fighting for no reason. But you know, once they wear you down enough and actually kill you they're gonna get more progression than you know they walked into this fight with and they're gonna get more loot and like i don't know it just doesn't make sense you know they definitely do need to tweak that i'm not sure if they are but yeah now to answer the big question is this game good or bad and i'm gonna have to say it depends on what your expectations for this game are if you're expecting for this game to get far and you know i'm gonna say this again i'm not trying to hate on the game but if you're expecting this game to go far you know i don't think it's worth it for you to play this you know if you're not playing for the pp you're playing for the progression and stuff like that then you know just don't play it but if you're playing just because you want to have something to play something to fight on you know like you just want to have fun you know yeah i like this game's good for that but you know like i said if you're in this for the long run nah but look guys like if you're in this for the long run and you know you're enjoying the progression and stuff like that you know don't let what i said stop you from playing if you feel like these devs are going to come here and clutch up then you know continue to play go with your gut you know i feel like the devs do actually have a chance of succeeding in this that's why i'm still playing this game today and you know of course i enjoy the pvp but uh yeah I hope this video was helpful for you guys though and you know if you're a subscriber or you know you're planning on coming back to this channel let me know if you guys want me to play this game more.
because at the end of the day I do actually enjoy this PvP and exploration and I am gonna I'm gonna I'm have to trust in these devs that they're gonna fix this up you know not saying there's a guarantee this is gonna happen but you know I just gotta hope but uh, yeah guys that's about it for today's video um, and yeah peace